Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. If these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer. That's not what I was expecting. See, this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. Nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. You can call me Harper. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying that aspect of your personality. Once you have been made useful, we'll see about that. No. What is that? This is the redstone heart. Beautiful. It can help you find your way home. How can I be sure we can trust this thing? The answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? That, that's a lot of stairs. And all revealed by the redstone heart. Amazing. Yeah, not bad, right? After you. Looks pretty ominous. Some sort of giant monster up here? Another evil computer? No, no, nothing like that, but you'll see. Come on. Ah, <sighs> feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree with some of the aesthetic choices. Oh, you just love being mysterious, don't you? Is that like your favorite thing? What? I don't know what you're talking about. I just try not to think about this place very often. Kinda thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. You don't sound super happy about being back. What's up? Yeah, I think you'll figure it out once you meet the others. Others? You mean we're going to meet more old builders? Still don't like it when you call us that. Yep, but I gotta warn you, they're not as friendly as I am. I'm probably the, uh nicest old builder uh-huh old builder social politics my goodness hey i'm just glad you're on our side old builder or not you've been pretty cool well thank you jesse i hope i can keep living up to that well you're gonna give us the atlas and then we can go home right kind of the atlas isn't exactly mine to give it belongs to the other uh old builders and well they might not want to give it up why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? Harper, I thought that's why we brought you. To convince them to hand over the Atlas. You're not gonna let us down, right? I'm gonna do my best, but I warn you now that there could be... complications. What kind of... complications? You'll see when you get there. Jesse, come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. Yeah, I do. She saved our lives, Lucas. Only after she put them in danger. If I remember correctly, we saved her just about as much as she saved us. Don't worry, okay? We're gonna get that Atlas and get home. I appreciate the vote of confidence, Jesse. Sorry. 
I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise I'm trying to help, Lucas. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. Oh, see a thing. Before you go in there, I have one more piece of advice. Don't die! What? <laughs> TNT back of the gladiators. Nice one, bro. Who do you think you are? Ah! Stop! I can tell you dudes are all angry, and I totally feel that, but I promise I do not make the rules here. That's them. Yes, we are the ones in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match. Ever. It definitely is strange, Mevia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately. This is going to require some reconfiguring of the stats, for sure. My friends are dead! You killed them! Wait, wait, wait. A and that's why you're ruining our games? Yeah, come on, jeez, how petty are you? Ugh, lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, I've got a game we could play. Okay, just tell me straight, what are these games that you keep talking about? I think if we all just calm down, I can explain. Your friends aren't dead. Wait, what? How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> that would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously. They come back, and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <gasps> <clears throat> Your friends are alive and well. Let my friends go. Sorry, sport, but they were eliminated. <laughs> Them's the rules. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. <clears throat> in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. 
Spill! No, oh, why bother? They all end up in the mines. Stairs. Lots of them. Are you being a Weisenheimer with me? Is that really what's going on? Wow. Say, so can we get somebody to kill this little moron for me, please? A few dozen times? <laughs> Easy, Hadrian. Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, champ. Why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? We came for the Atlas. I want you to hand it over so my friends and I can go home. Straight into the point. Well, I'd like it. If I weren't simmering with barely controlled rage right now. Hmm. We're, of course, not going to do any of those things, but admirable try. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything? To someone like you. You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Yeah, ask Harper. She's the one helping. Um, right. Yes. Believe me, Hadrian, when you see what Jesse has, let's just say it will pique your interest. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. Oh, send them to the mines. They're cheaters. Let's... How about my sword? Wow. A sword. Is it sharp? I don't deserve to be here, Adrian. It's it? How about this flint and steel? We have castles filled with chests, which are filled with flints and steels. Oh, how embarrassing. They haven't been eliminated. Therefore, I present... The Eversource crown. Wait, why do I recognize that? Oh, that's the crown we put on the Eversource chickens so we'd be able to tell them apart from the regular chickens. Oh, that was a good party, huh? Sadly, not exactly valuable. <laughs> I'd be delighted to have them in the mines. How about a white pumpkin? Oh, wow. I haven't seen one of those since Cassie left. Oh, don't say that name. She still gives me nightmares. <laughs> Is that who you got that from? I don't know what she told you, but those things aren't exactly valuable. What about this? Huh? <gasps> I present the Redstone Heart. Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off with that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Thing's no toy, Slugger. How about you just hand it over, huh? It can be, uh, pretty dangerous if... You don't know how to use it. <coughs> Harper. Huh. Uh, nope. This is mine. Not gonna happen. Oh, really? Let me tell you how this is gonna go. Here's the way my offer works. You give me the heart. You and your friends go back down to those portals. I never look at your insignificant face again. Wait, without the Atlas? But how will we get home? So, not my problem. I don't play that way, Hadrian. If I can't have the Atlas, you can't have the Redstone Heart. Come on, gang, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm, I'm sure we could reach an agreement that suits everyone. Well, kiddo, I admit, you do drive a hard bargain. I'm, I'm sure I could think of something fair for the both of us. Well, you need the Atlas, and I need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, the Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me. Everyone enjoys these games. Can't wait to see what the other games are. I hope they're fun. Well, there you have it. A deal's been struck, huh? To the games! All right, then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, event. Enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose, Harper has to go to the mines, too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. Jesse, this was not part of the plan. 
wrapped up in one of Hadrian's deals. Ugh, he's not one to let other people get the upper hand, you know. Harper, how bad is this gonna be? Give it to me straight. It's not gonna be a cakewalk, that's for sure. Hadrian has people play the games now just for his own amusement. Yeah, he seemed like a real treat. Ugh, I'm, I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. We used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Well, here it is, the competitor village, sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep, at least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Wow, that's just horrible. I know. Mm. <laughs> they didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games, but it might take a while. I'm going to go confer with Otto. We go way back, and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait, we still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. Ugh, I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines, which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Huh, seems like Hadrian's trying to make sure we all know who's boss. You always did catch on quick. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. We gotta get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. there's our nether portal. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat! Wait a minute, you're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slav! And face meat doesn't like cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat air. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines! Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on face meat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Staring at face meat. Please, what can I do to get them out? Well, now that you mention it, face meat was busy slamming mad raps at the gym and missed lunchtime. You see? So face meat's hungry. Do something about that, and face meat'll think about getting your friends out. Sort of practice space. Looks like everyone's working hard. Oh, smells like it too. Whoa, it's you from Spleef. You were like amazing. I am now, and I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your probs upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> yeah, I am pretty upset. Totally get it, bro. I will never do that to one of your friends again because, man, I do not want to be on your bad side. I gotta say, you keep playing like that and you'll be like, Tim status. Tim who? Tim! Like the legend of Tim Tim. 
on the signs. Like one, okay? Like you could. People could like already be talking. They're gonna like say stuff. Compare you to Tim. I'm not here to be a Tim. I just want to get home. But that's like exactly what makes you Tim status. Tim didn't want to be Tim either. He got his whole team home. Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you. So if you ever need anything, you just come and ask. Shall? No, I mean seriously. I mean anything at all. Well, actually, I'm trying to bribe that guard. Face me, and he's hungry. Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, quick before anybody sees us. Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah. It'll grow back. Just uh, leave the seeds, yeah? One. Planting as I go. And that's another. <laughs> Sweet! And that should all grow back soon. Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Then I guess I'll just have to make my own. Where can I get some wood planks? Hey, I remember a bunch of, like, wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by, like, punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no prob. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Hey, no hard feelings. I didn't know what I'd gotten into. Let's just move past this. No. I will eliminate you next round and make you suffer. It'll be fun for me. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long, so you wouldn't know. Good luck, Em. I know that the best person will win. Seriously? You know you're looking at the best person. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. No, you don't understand. I have to win. Winning is the only way my friends and I can go home. <gasps> is that how it works? That's what we're all trying to do. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. for a table. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. Wow, 
Wow, hey, you are that crazy person in extreme spleef. Decent. Not as good as Tim, but decent. That's more than I can say for most. Everybody loves Tim around here. Uh, yeah, and justifiably so. He literally saved his entire team, and in style. His armor didn't even get dirty. He's a real Tim-spiration. Yeah, it's true. He could do the Tim-possible. Here's the secret. We're all just trying to be like Tim. He's perfect. Okay, I'll leave you to it then. Hmm. Impressive. Hey, that's Lucas's journal. You say something, Tiny? Because I'm trying to read here. Hey, where'd you get that book you're reading? Oh, this? Fished it out some respawn's inventory after he... <sighs> it's got some tales of adventure, feelings, and other dumb stuff. Hey, wait a minute! You're the pipsqueak that knocked me out of my tower. Yeah, and this belonged to that little blonde buddy of yours. Let me guess. You want this back? Because I'm actually enjoying myself. There are some fascinating and thrilling tales in here. Hey, don't get too steam. Maybe we can make a deal? F Slab, the immovable. Oh, we can make a deal. If you do everything I say, when I say it, and don't make me mad again, maybe I'll consider giving you this stupid book back. Mm. Excuse me. Psh, wow, rude. Hey, get out of here before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <laughs> it's so nice when new contestants are in the village. Have you happened to see my friends? You know, the ones that got eliminated in Spleef? No, but if I do, I will make them wish for elimination again. Yeesh, why is everyone so cranky around here? Could be that we're forced into an endless cycle of destruction. Just a guess, though. Would it be possible for me to uh, have some of that bread? It's for that guy over there. Seriously? I'm not falling for that. No bread until lunchtime. Get out of here before I make you into a meal. Does anyone have any food I can borrow or will have? I guess I should ask around. really want to win this thing. Here lies the platform on which Tim stood to win these great games. Hope I'll be standing there soon. Um, hello? What do you know about the old builders who run this place? Well, one, they hate being called old builders. Two, their face meets bosses. Three, they're not big on hugs. Hey, what do you even do around here? Face meet cracks skulls and thinks about cracking more skulls. When face meet has time, that is. Hey, face meet, got some bread for you. Bread, huh? It's not cake, but Facemeat is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. 
It took me a long time to make that bread, so you better hold up your end of the deal. Jeez, face me, didn't know you were so demanding. Wait here. Hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. First with Palma, now with that stupid sploof game. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You know, don't make this awkward. Hey, of course I saved you, okay? You're one of my best friends. Well, I just hope Ivor isn't too jealous. I'm glad you're with me in this, Petra. Me too. Here! Oh! Oh, response! Jesse, man, is it good to see you. You too, Lucas. And Ivor. Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up. My outfit breathes wonderfully. Anyway, how's it been going out here? You, uh, you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary. I'm working on that. It's tricky, though. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. Don't worry, we're just in this tournament where if we win, we get the Atlas and our ticket home. Oh, well that's better than I thought. But if we lose, we'll be mining for quartz forever. Nope, that is not a thing I want. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just... <sighs> stare at you while you mine. Lucas, we need the Atlas to get home. <sighs> I know. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. So you're the one who's supposed to help us? Well, I'll enforce the rules at any rate. If that helps you, then uh, can't be games without rules. <laughs> Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting. You being here. Tim. Please. I could do anything he can do better. Well, you might just be right about that, Jesse. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm Winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what the next event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. <laughs> it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Melia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleef, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh. I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course about our plucky newcomers. Shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, 
Don't forget to be like Tim out there. <sighs> Wonder how this is gonna go. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these pompous jerks. Yeah, I'm right there with you. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race! We've totally got this! <laughs> got this, huh? Boom! Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. Winning. Ooh, in the zone, huh? That's excellent. That's just excellent. Hope you managed to hang on to that optimism when the heat's on out there. I admire your confidence, Jesse, but I must ask, what makes you think you can win when so many others have failed? Huh? Do you really think you're special? Whatever you're throwing at us can't be any worse than the other stuff we've already survived. Oh, really? Because it seems like two members of your team have already been eliminated. Yeah, and there's two left. More than enough to win this. Yes, perhaps we should just get on with this. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. <laughs>